What's cracking, kids? LA Nick, back in America. So, I found something today. I had to buy it. Look at that. Montessa 348 trail. It's really nice, too. Got the original Montessa straps. Everything. I mean, it's never been. And it's got a title. Title and tagged. It is freaking cool, man. Everything about this bike's cool. Look at the little M on the straps. I don't, I think it's bone stock, man. I don't see anything off on it. I know the fenders are right. Maybe someone upgraded the shocks to those air shocks, but it's got the, the brake switch on it. It's pretty nice. Montessa front fender and rear fender with the light kit. This, this rubber's cracked. I'll try to find one of those. But it's pretty cool. It came with that tank too. A Coda 349 trial seat tank. But I like the trail. I'll leave it like it is. It's freaking cool. I can't believe I got it. It's, it's popped up on Marketplace for 1500 bucks. And I called the guy, messaged him, and said, here's my number. He messaged me back saying, you bought an OSA from me a couple of years ago. And then I, I remembered who he was. Good two-hour drive for me, but well worth it. This bike's cool. You don't see too many of these, the big Montessas. I come across a lot of 125s and all, but never the 350s. And it's streetable, man. You can ride it on the street. It's the only thing missing is this rubber. If anyone has one. Hit me up, man. I need it. I like my stuff complete. So, I don't think this is the original vent hose. I, I got an old one I put on there. So, yeah, I picked that up today. I think it's cool. Maybe my favorite dirt bike I own. And I'll show you this. I brought some stuff back from Italy. So, I went to the email of swap meet. Beautiful day here in Minnesota. Spectacular. So I bought a, that's a, uh, Benelli Say Head I'm doing. But yeah, I brought some stuff back from Emola, and this is one of them. Check this thing out, man. I'm going to bring it outside, because you can't really see it. But before I bring it outside, I'll show you some other stuff. I, I found these Cherryani shocks with orange springs for the orange crush bike. So I had, couldn't pass those up, and they're like per, brand new. And they're Cherryani, so they're old. But I'll bring this rim outside so you can see it. I'll turn this light on. There's the beamer. Finally got it done with the bags. Some of the vanillas. But I'll take this rim outside so you can really look at it. Because the light's no good in my garage. Unless I open the door and I don't want the... Right now it's nice in there. I don't want temperature change. Okay, check this thing out, man. Have you ever seen anything like it, ever? It is just crazy. I mean crazy. I've never seen anything like it. It's very strange. The way it has those scoops going in there. I don't know if you can see because I'm shadowing it. But it's pretty unusual. Because it goes this way and the air just goes in there. And when you open it up, there's another thing of fins in there. You can see them spinning. It's pretty crazy. I've been, I've gotten a little bit of feedback from what it came off of. I was told in Italy that it came off of a 72 Laverta SFC. And they only made three of them. Of these wheels. So, but I haven't confirmed that yet. But it's pretty neat. It's got an intake and an outtake. It needs a little bit of polishing and some sanding and polishing. But it's pretty nice. But I paid a lot of money for it. But I, when I see something I've never seen before, I buy it. Because where are you going to find that? I'll build a bike out just around this wheel. I'm already on the look for, lookout for Laverta 750. Because this is... You know, this is stuff that you just don't come across. Legend stuff. I mean, it's a cool wheel. 
everything about it's cool anyway i got my work cut out for me i got to get back on this mojave it's wiring i hate wiring work the orange crush bikes is i just gotta put those shocks on and fuel line jersey don't need anything that's the one i just traded for the the cz and some other dirt bikes i know if everyone's it's a replica or whatever but i like it it's fast super clean it needs nothing starts right up instantly someone said the gauge clusters are wrong but it says right on it le mans they said it's a gl gauge cluster but it says le mans right on it i mean that's you can't fake that so someone must have changed it these are the same as the benelli say same gauges but I don't care. I, I'm not. I didn't buy it to sell. I got the the right blinkers, the right flashers, same as the Benelli. So I'll swap those out. These are Honda. So I'll put the CVs back on it. But I, I think it's a nice bike. It rides really nice, and it's got no miles on it. So this is going bye bye. It's just not my thing. It's a big tank. All these are staying though. And then all the dirt bikes are down at the barn, so I'm trying to keep them separated so they don't fight. All right, see you guys. See you soon. Glad to be back in America. Well, I like being in Italy, but it's always nice to be home. See you.